you know, a lot of people are having to kind of master their own stuff. So people start thinking about mixing and mastering at the same time. And so I just wanted to get your take and your approach to that issue. When I start on a project from day one of recording, I'm always thinking of what it is going to be when it's mixed and ultimately mastered. So I make placements in monitoring while we're monitoring, while we're recording. I'm combining things, I'm placing them in the panning. Um, I'm doing an EQ on the way to the recorder so that I don't have to make these decisions later. And ultimately, those things are meant to make mixing easier. So it's already thought out when I go to mix. The trick that I've found is to get an approval from a client that mix has to sound competitive with what's on the radio, which has already been mastered. So I'm always going to do some pre-mastering just to get the client happy and excited. And so we can really actually understand what it'll sound like. So I want to start right away with understanding where the mix is going to be and then ultimately the mastering.